Nice warm day for Memorial Day yesterday and uh, the weather cooperating enough to kind of ease you back into the work week if it's just starting for you back up today. Look at that beautiful morning glow from the sun working its way on up from our ABC Seamless camera North 48th and Cornhusker Highway train rolling in the background. Some of you starting your morning a little early with traffic starting to pick up on that side of town. Temperatures have been dipping a little bit more and farther into the lower 50s at this point. 54 in Lincoln with one of those cooler spots at Columbus upper 40s right now. It'll certainly notice it's just a touch cooler out there than it was at this time yesterday. And maybe you don't know that if you weren't up at this time yesterday and I wouldn't blame you if you weren't 55 degrees in Nebraska City, a little bit warmer in Fall City at 56 and Hastings at 57. Overall, the forecast today is pretty similar to what we saw yesterday, maybe even a touch warmer than really what we saw with those winds kind of quieting down a little bit, still around 10 to 25 miles per hour and still of the northwest. But uh, the calmest point in terms of the winds today will be through the morning as you're seeing out there right now. Calm in Lincoln, calm up towards Columbus and York, as well as down towards Beatrice, just a little bit stronger, around five to seven miles per hour out towards the Tri Cities and Kearney in Grand Island. Now, looking across the state, you'll notice that most of us are cloud free, especially in eastern Nebraska, northern Nebraska, until you get down to southwest Nebraska. A few of these clouds kind of associated with maybe a few sprinkles at this point, and we're kind of being split by that round and a little bit more light rain and scattered rain up towards Sioux Falls that'll continue to track south and east. So most of us kind of being in that middle ground, that no man's land here across Nebraska, not expecting a whole lot. It'll be a dry day for a lot of us as that cloud cover kind of splits us and we see a mostly sunny day again throughout much of this evening. Now that's going to change. This weather pattern really going to break down as we go into Wednesday afternoon and Wednesday evening. You'll notice some of these storms already starting to pop up off the front range and into portions of the sand hills going into uh, Scott's Bluff and areas out in the panhandle, especially going to see some of these stronger storms forming pretty quickly first and then they kind of continue to work their way a little bit farther east as we go into Wednesday night. They try to hold together in central Nebraska before as you can see trying to continue into eastern Nebraska, bringing us the weaker variety by the morning. Severe threat really kind of diminishing at this point. It's really going to be as they're initially popping up through portions of western Nebraska that they could be threatening damaging wind gusts and uh, some larger hail with this round. But that severe weather risk, as you can see, really drops off as that round tries to maintain itself into eastern Nebraska. Storms will still be possible for us, especially by Wednesday afternoon, evening and into early Friday. That's the last couple of days of May until we're into early June, 1st of June on Saturday. And then we'll uh, continue to watch some off and on storm chances again through this upcoming weekend before those chances drop off and we really warm up going into the following week. All right, sounds good. Thank you very much, Jessica.